Hey everyone, thanks for joining me again. Today, I'm forging a pair of curtain tie hooks. I'm cutting out two 7 inch lengths of half inch diameter round bar. I've roughly indicated the size of the tabs, but I'll set this at the anvil soon. This first heat, I'm focused on getting a clean shoulder formed. I've marked out the length I want, and after setting in with the edge, I've straightened the bar so I'm working the length of the tab. Now I have a starting point, I can work this tab down to its final thickness. A few blows to the side square it up. I'm punching in divots so the screw heads can fit flush. I ended up using button head screws for this project, so this didn't do a ton. Either way, it looks nice and means I have less material to drill through later. Now that I'm happy with the tab end, I'm spinning it around and isolating the ball from the rest of the arm using a guillotine tool. The first heat, I'm focused on getting an accurate mark so that on the second I can forge the neck to its final thickness. I'm placing the arm over the far edge of the anvil so I can start to taper it. Now I'm returning to focus on the transition area with a smaller hammer. This makes it easier for me to place my strikes without accidentally messing up the ball. I can start to round the ball by knocking off the corners now. As the ball cools, I lighten my blows to planish out any high spots. Thank you. 
I'm taking the bar from square to octagonal at the transition. I'm returning to this larger hammer to finish the taper. I square the bar up first by working it on four sides. Now I can finish the arm by knocking off the corners and cleaning the taper up. Here, I'm punching my initials into the steel. I'm drilling two eighth inch holes using the divots I previously punched to locate them. I'm starting and finishing the bend of the arm at the horn, but off camera, I take it over to the vise and get it roughly positioned with some scrolling tongs. Now I'm wire wheeling the hooks to remove all of the oxides and reveal bare steel. The steel isn't quite hot enough here, but I'm wiping the hooks down with paste wax to develop a shiny black coating on them.
Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please consider liking or subscribing. If you didn't, let me know what I can improve on for next time.